Let's do it. Yeah. All right, first story. The board overseeing the Los Angeles Unified School District has cut $25 million from the budget for school police and will use the money to help fund an achievement plan for black students. The plan approved by the school board Tuesday will cut 70 sworn officers, 62 non-sworn officers, and one support staff position from the Los Angeles School Police Department, leaving it with a force of 211 officers. In addition, police officers will no longer be allowed to use pepper spray on students. Hey, Rochester, New York, you paying attention? This is on top of the $150 million already slashed from the Los Angeles Police Department budget last year. It's worth noting that among the police equipment owned by the Los Angeles Unified School District, Jennifer, is an armored personnel carrier. You get 60 seconds to unpack it. I'm sorry, armored personnel carrier? Well, I think this is actually fantastic news. If they're going to funnel that money from defunding and slashing their police force in the LA, you know, public schools um, and, you know, channel it into an achievement program that will actually help black students. Um, I'm all for it. I I don't, I, I mean, I know that um, <laughs> there are, you know, different LA school district encompasses many different socioeconomic classes. Um, and I'm sure that a high majority of the police force is concentrated in the areas um, that are, tend to be uh, more poverty level, uh, BIPOC occupied areas. So I'm hoping that a lot of the slashing they're doing and funding of achievement programs goes to those areas that most need it. Um, but other than that, I think this is a good story and I don't understand why they have an armored personnel carrier. Uh, what does that even look like? 